Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm super excited because we have a Dell Pro Max 16 and we are unboxing this powerhouse laptop. This is a Dell high performance machine designed for creators, engineers and anyone who needs extreme computing power. So let's dive right in. As we open the box, the first thing we see is the laptop itself wrapped securely along with that. It also include a 130 watt type C adapter. You can see the power cable. So this represents the C type cable just to be connected to the power cord. So let's open the Okay, so here is the first look of the laptop itself. Looks to be sleek and the premium build. You can see on the back side the Pro Max branding, branding. Premium look and some documentations. So let's keep this aside and have one's look on the laptop. So the Dell has the branding at the top. Let's turn it on the other side. Quite easy to open. So it has the backlight keyboard. You can see the Intel Ultra 9 label. So let's take a quick look on the left hand side. We have HDMI cable then USB, then we have two Thunderbolt C type. Then you can see SD card reader as well. So this looks to be the top view. And on the right hand side, you can see the security slot, then LAN cable to attach, then USB, headphone jack, and lastly you have eSIM option as well. So let's take a quick look again. So it has the backlight keyboard, camera shutter option is also there. Intel Ultra Core 9 label. So quite easy to close. Looks to be a premium finish. Along with this uh, purchase order, I also got the Dell backpack. So this is the Dell EcoLoop Pro backpack as a part of the package during the purchase order. So let's take out. So this is suitable for 14 to 16 inch laptop. Looks to be wrapped properly. Let's have a quick look of this from inside. looks to be premium in the first view has a number of compartments as you can see to put your stuffs as the accessories that are with your laptop so on the back side here it is the place for your laptop you can attach it securely and keep it inside along with this we have got the Dell wireless mouse as well. So this is also part of the package along with the purchase order which has been raised. So let's take it out. And here it is inside. We'll see the wireless mouse with batteries included inside so let's remove this sticker over here and have the first impression of how it looks like 
sounds to be okay looks to be premium need to check the durability how it works out so let's come back to the laptop again so you have the power button and let's do the initial setup you must need to be connected to the internet for the process to be followed this is a customized version and you can see the backlight is also been there let's step in just few moments as you can see the intel ultra 9 label this may take a while as you can go in select the country or region select the language the keyboard input method and you must need to be get connected to internet as you might need to download some necessary files so enter the wifi connections connected to the internet and let's wait for some time to get it connected and let the windows to install the prerequisite files which are been as part of the process so let's move ahead uh, when the checking for the updates and uh, this may consume some time you must be connected to good internet connectivity so this might takes time yeah you need to connect uh, the power cable while doing this process so let's uh, move further we can see the dell branding appears and will almost be there so we can take a quick look of how the process is again this may consume some time as there are some three steps involved in downloading the necessary files so let's take a quick look on this side yeah look so let's see the detail specification from the top you can see the one power button with optional fingerprint reader and second the precision touchpad uh, here it shows uh, the first that is uh, for nano sim card slot uh, then global headset port then usb 3.2 generation 1 5g bps port with power share then ethernet port and lastly the security cable slot so let's look from the other end so the first one hdmi port then usb 3.2 generation 1 then 2 thunderbolt port with power delivery and display port power and battery status light and fifth one uh, micro uh, sd card slot and lastly the sixth uh, one smart card reader slot that is again optional it's to be quite premium again some few minutes that we may required to completely set up the process ensure that you are connected 
with a power cable and that's it inside uh, let's take a quick look of the internal things as you can see here the C drive where the windows has been installed you can see the space which is here now let's go to the task manager and see the configurations of the system so here you can see the CPU so the base feed shows a 2.90 gigahertz uh, CPU then uh, the number of cores and number of logical processes you can see then memory you can just have a quick look around 64 GB of RAM has been with the given configuration then your C drive capacity then internal GPU and this is NVIDIA RTX Pro which is selected for this configuration that's it thank you